In this video, a nurse will understand the various aspects of fallist assessment and postfall assessment. In some hospitals, small fallist assessment scale is used in some modified version. And in such situation, it is known as modified MOS fall risk assessment scale, in which they had added a patient who are under the age of 18 years, above the age of 65 years, and the patient was admitted in ICU, HDU, or emergency. They all are considered at the high risk for fall. Sir, I need to check the fall risk assessment such that we could prevent you from the fall, and it is our responsibility too. Okay, so I will ask you some few questions. So you just need to answer it. Uh, so do you have any secondary diseases such as hypertension, diabetes, or asthma, or something like that? Yeah, I do have hypertension. All right, sir. So you are having secondary diagnosis. So I will score you fifteen for that. Twenty. And I need to check the medication. Just a minute, sir. I will check the medication for your fall. If any medication which leads to fall, because as you are a hypertensive patient, so you might be on the antihypertensive medication. So which can lead to fall? Because what happens is, sir, uh, your that hypertensive level of BP is very much high. So the medication which you are taking it can make your blood pressure low. So it can lead to dizziness, sir. So it can lead to fall. So I need to check it. Okay. So I will score it over here twenty. So to see your gate, if you don't mind, can you walk from here to there slowly, sir? Right. Okay. Right. You can turn. Right. I can see that you are having the flank pain and due to that your gait is little bit weak. Yes. Okay, so I will score you then 10. 